watu wangu mshaba marekani uh, <clears throat> tulishaogea kuhusu mambo na hosting sasa uh, ni ta fast forward ushapata host uh, sababu mtapata host um, but hiyo tutaogea baadaye unafaa ku behave ukiwa kwa host so first of all tulisikizana hiyo maneno tulisikizana kuna kuseduce kuna kuseduce bibi za yenyewe hakuna kuanyemelea unaelewa na wasichana kuna kuseduce bwana za yenyewe hakuna kuva ni kama unaelewa ni kama uko kwa ujue hapa hakuna ati my, my, my body my right my clothes my right hizo 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 hakuna una hostiwa so unava kama mtu una, uko na adabu unaishi kwa bwana yenyewe uh, wanaweza kuwa wako na teenage sons wanaweza kuwa wako na teenage daughters so unava kama mtu uko na ada, adabu so hiyo tushaeweka aside na hakuna kulala na bwana za wenyewe na bibi za yenyewe kama uko na hiyo spirit kwanza enda uobewe enda ukeshe enda uted kesha iko nearest your church na uabie pastor your weakness ni ati wewe uko na ofisi sana na you, you unataka hiyo ofisi itolewe hiyo iko ndani yako so unafaa ku behave aje so the first thing ukienda kwa huyu host unaelewa mshapita hiyo honeymoon phase so umechukuliwa airport ni 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 by then taendelea na hako ka story i think tulikuwa day ya kwanza ushachukuliwa kwa airport nitaendelea wale mlikuwa mnasikiza hako ka story so ushapita hiyo honeymoon umechukuliwa airport uh, ni 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 umefika kwa nyumba ni 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 siku ya kwanza maybe you are still honeymoon phase so make sure umekaa na host wako mezani hata kama mliogea online size ndio mnaogea face to face bukae na host wako mezani ah uh, ndio muogee kuhusu expectations uh, vitu ko expected na maybe ao wenye wataweza kukusaidia unaelewa uh, kama mliogea kwa simu that is very very different uh, face to face ni very muhimu sana sababu naweza soma body language so The first thing wewe unajua na vocalize kwa host wako ni ati host akiku host kuna kitu anataka anataka wewe ujisimamishe. Naelewa kuna wenye umepata ma host makorofia wanataka kukufanya slave, hawataki hawataki hata kukufundisha gari, hawataki uh, upate kazi, hawataki maybe kusikia ukiogea na watu wenyu, hawataki hata umwede church nao juu sijui nini utawamalizia madazi kama mshaba o hawataki tena uonekane yani yani ni kama wanataka wakufiche kwa nyumba usikuwe successful so wachana na miss yoke kuhusu wanaogea host wale most host the first thing wanataka ni ujisimamishe utoke kwao tunasikizana host anataka ujisimamishe toke kwa kwao ndio akuage proud smage <laughs> ato kiona jona kiriga hapa ndio nimeka ka host hapa marekani naelewa nimekafundisha hapa kuendesha gari nikakafundisha kushika fork nikakafundisha kukula kuku eh, na kisu na, na fork sio na mikono nikakafundisha kupeana tips so ato kiona kana riga hapo ni mimi nimelea hii ni mimi nimelea so it's human nature kutaka credit unaelewa so there's nothing wrong mtu akijisifu hivyo ni human nature na na feel proud unaelewa so uh, najua ingine inaweza kuwa ni sarcasm but they, they, they will be very proud hata ukiwa mzazi unaligaga hivyo unasema <laughs> watoto ni mwao fasomesha wame graduate my son is an engineer doctor my son is a is a is a horse doctor My daughter is a veterinarian, is a, is a chicken doctor. Unaelewa hizo zote. So mzazi anajisifu hivyo. Uh, so host anataka ujisimamishe, ndio aweze kujisifu hivyo na ndio aweze ku feel proud of you. Anataka ujisimamishe aje. So anataka ujisimamishe ndio utoke kwake. The first thing sababu you will need to drive. Okay? So unahitaji driver's license. Huku ni process. So host ana expect unaelewa wewe uta, utachukua hiyo kitabu siku hizi materials iko online every every state utaenda kuna 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 hiyo department of motor vehicle na kuna hiyo kitabu utasoma rules za barabara ziko different according to ile state unaenda so 
kuna hiyo process inaenda first of all una, unasomea unasoma nini theory Dio, ukisomea theory kuna kaka kitabu utatoa kwa, kwa utapewa kwa DMV unaweza bia host akuletee ama hii material inaweza 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 DMV ni Department of Motor Vehicles uh, ama host ama unaweza ziona zi, zi, mostly kuna kaka kitabu Kenya wame wameandika wanataka wataku interview wataku examinate so ako kaka kitabu ndio ka kwanza that is the first book mazee kama upendi vitabu that is the first book utafaa kusoma marekani sahau rules za barabara zenye umelan Kenya sababu most of them azita apply huku they are very different na every state has many many those rules so unahitaji yako kwa kitabu kako curated haya hiyo kizungu ni cura- curated ni nini mtu aniambia hapo but kako curated naitumia sababu ina sound ni kama ni kizungu iko imeenda im, 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 majuu so curated for that state so ukisoma itakuambia rules za barabara ni nini nini sasa hako ukisoma ufeel you know the materials zenye ziko hapo na tuta dive into that later then utaenda kwa driver's license uh, office zenye ziko karibu alafu atakufanyisha theory test fanyishwa theory test then u, u, unapewa permit sasa unaweza unaweza una ku, ku, kufundishwa kuendesha gari na hiyo permit na mtu mzima cover 21 then after permit uh, ukshap kuwa poa utaenda sasa ufanye skills test sasa yako ku drive mta drive na either police ama whoever kulingana na hiyo state maybe mwalimu fukipita upate license so host anataka kwanza you upate license sababu license is like your freedom utaweza kuendesha gari bila license utaweza kununua gari bila license so unahitaji license diweze kuendesha gari na hapo ndio freedom yako inaanza kushika license so that's the first thing in your mind kushika license ah uh, na unajua hii license ndio watakuitisha wakikuhaya sababu wameandika address yako hapo kwa license wanajua age yako hizo vitu zote so license the second thing atataka upate ni kazi kwa sababu utanunua gari na nini unless umetoka na, na cash Kenya unless maybe umepewa gari na, na, na host for free so you need kazi na hiyo time ukienda kazi kama uko na license host wako anaweza kuachia gari saa zile hezi kuendesha kazini ama anaweza ku drop unaenda unapata pesa so ukipata kazi hizo pesa una save usianze kutumia watu wenyu kwanza block watu wenyu kabisa usiwatumie pesa sababu ukianza kuwatumia pesa na hiyo backtracking na host anataka ukue na pesa utoke huko sababu utahitaji ku save pesa ya kununua gari uh, na, na pesa ya down payment ya, ya security deposit ndioweza kupata apartment kwa kwa kuishi so ukianza kupata pesa tu dogo hapo unatumia watu Kenya guess what tunaanza ku backtrack mtaanza kusubwana na host hata shido unategeneza pesa zinaenda wapi so ukipata kazi save hizo pesa unaona wajiweke hizo pesa usiziguze sasa hizi unaishi kwa host hata kuitishi anything save that money ndioweza kupata pesa ukifikisha almost elfu, elfu, nine, elfu tano na within a month ukichapa kazi sana yes na in this case by the way naongea kuhusu kama umekuja na green card sababu kama umekuja any other way it can be uh, it can be challenging even in terms of driver's license na na kupata kazi depending on the state na ile visa umekuja na so hapa tunaongea mostly mtu amekuja na green card so uh, ukipata ukisevizo pesa utakuwa na pesa enough ya kununua ya kununua gari. So utasevizo pesa, ikifika uh, kitu 1400 1500 utaweza kupata gari, alafu unaelewa hata unaweza eda uweke down payment, but niliwaambia usinunu usiende kujiwekea kigari kikubwa sababu utaanza kuingia kwa madeni kwa Marekani. huku uh, Marekani that hiyo ndio kitu nataka u avoid kuingia kwa madeni. So probably utapata gari from 1500 kwenda juu unaelewa itapita mostly of tano kagari kana move unaelewa from point a to b usianze hapa kusema oh mimi nataka Mercedes mimi nataka BMW au jafika hiyo level na by the way you can get your gari but sasa utaanza na madeni marekani sababu all they need ni down payment do not put yourself kwa madeni sababu unaona gari gari yenye unanunua hivyo yes utapo ile gari unataka hii gari ujue kama ni hizo makina Mercedes Benz akina akina BMW do you know ku register BMW hiyo taxes 
kama kuna property tax unalipaga over a thousand dollars a hundred thousand za Kenya kui register tu na sasa hiyo ni, ni mwaka mzee mzee ikiwa miaka mpya mpya how much utalipa igari ujo insurance yake itakuwa very high unaelewa insurance yake itakuwa very high sababu ni, ni, ni gari mpya okay na payment utakuwa na ili pia kila mwezi so utakuwa unaona seme property tax maybe ku register imekukura kama 1500 hizo ni 150k uh, za Kenya igari itahitaji insurance unahitaji full coverage unaelewa kuna insurance hizo tutaogea kuna liability na, na comprehensive ama full coverage hiyo utahitaji utakuwa unalipa sababu wewe ni driver mpya utakuwa unalipa expensive wanaweza kugoga hata 400 insurance ama 300 which is 30000 ama 40000 za Kenya so imagine 30000 za Kenya okay hizo lazima ulipe every month insurance kwa sababu unafaa ku maintain insurance then kuna ipe gari payment Jume, umesema unataka Mercedes Benz ama BMW sasa hii una na nimenunua BMW tuseme ya, ya 1.5 million ama ama 2.5 million ama what 1 million unailipia every month jueni mpya na hata hujajenga credit 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 ni yani inaonyeshana history ya payments zenye umekuwa ukimake unaelewa kama una trust na pesa za, za watu so hujajenga credit so interest rate yako itakuwa very high so guess what unaweza jipata unalipa almost 400 a month kulipa hii gari mpaka ile time utamaliza kuilipa so umeje hivi marekani umejiwekea 500 400 hiyo 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 ni insurance hiyo insurance obviously utahepa umejiogezea mie, kama ingine nne so every month na hii gari inahitaji gas every month hii hii gari yako inakula almost 100k za mtaani na hiyo 100k umeanza hapa mpya hiyo ni kama salary yako ya, 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 ya one week one week and a half so na mwezi iko na wiki kama nne mtu wangu utaanza kuhema alafu ukipata nyumba Unaona itakuwa inakula sarare kama yako ya wiki tatu. Itabidi unafanya makazi kama mbili kulingana na ile state umeenda. So ukigia Marekani unajaribu ku minimize kulipa watu kwa sababu the system here ni kulipa, kupe kupe pe pe pe. Unalipia this, unalipia that, unalipia that. So ndio unaona mtu huku Marekani anaweza kuwa na milioni moja za Kenya month. Na anakuonyesha lakini akianza kufanya mahesabu za subtraction. <laughs> una ile kwai um, bills za marekani zinakuchapa mnaitaka e, aje hiyo character development ama character what inakufanyia inakuonyesha mchanga kivumbi ingine sababu kacheka kanaanza kuduido unatoa hapa unatoa pale mie ni insurance mie ni mie unatoa hivyo so utaki kununua gari yenye unalipia unataka gari cash umalizane na hiyo you 